To demonstrate how great the multi one is to use, we will prepare a no-bake cheesecake using both the prep zone and the mix zone. So let's get started. First of all, we will remove the hub and attach the food processor. Ensure that it's fully clicked in. We have our knife blade in. We will then add eight digestive biscuits. We can break them in half, but we don't need to worry too much because the knife blades will do it for us. Attach our lid and again ensure that that clicks in as well. And now we will use speed five to break up our biscuits. So now I've already melted 50 grams of butter, which we will add down the feed tube. Remember to take our lid out first. And we'll give that a quick pulse up, make sure it's all mixed. So now our biscuits and our butter are all blended together and we are ready to put them in the dishes. So we'll remove the lid and the knife blade. Grab our dishes and spoon the mixture in. So now we've compacted our biscuit base, we can pop them in the fridge for half an hour whilst we make our very tasty topping. So now on to the topping. Let's replace our hub, lift the head up, attach our splash guard and start with the ingredients. 220 grams of cream cheese and now we'll add 400 millilitres of whipping cream. and 50 grams of caster sugar. And lastly, we'll pop two teaspoons of vanilla essence in. And now we're ready to attach our K beater. Pop that in there, lower the head and turn to speed three. So now our K-beater has done its job perfectly and thickened our mixture, ready for it to go on the biscuit base. So now we'll use our handy spatula, which also comes with a multi one, to remove some of the excess from the K-beater and we're ready to put our topping on our base. So, we get a lovely big dollop. So now that's complete, we can add our black currant compote. So now we've added our fruit compote to our cheesecake, we can pop them in the fridge until we're ready to eat them. And that's how quick and easy it is to make a no-bake cheesecake with the Kenwood Multi One. You can find other recipes at kenwoodworld.com.